Let's see how you like this. Just open, damn it. You must be one of the slave acolytes. Pretty easy to see why Overseer Harkon was horrified. Regardless, Lord Zash has made it clear that all new acolytes must learn martial skills as well as face their trials. Though why anyone thinks you can be taught is beyond me. Watch yourself. I don't respond well to idiots with big egos. I'm... Fluttering with fear. Fluttering. You will find the instructors in the Academy's archive. Hurry, and try not to embarrass your betters. You better not be wasting my time, slave. You better have the holocron. Hmm. A fake. Or stolen from the library, probably. I'll deal with you later. 
Now, I believe it's time for another demonstration. Gur, step forward. Yes, Overseer. Fon, kill him. With pleasure, Overseer. <sighs> Let Gur be an example to you. Fon destroyed him easily, like he will destroy all of you. Are there any other objections? You are only giving us power, Harkon. And your comments are only hastening your death, slave. Now the rest of you know the next trial. Go. You, slave, stay here. Now, slave. You think yourself pretty clever getting that holocron, don't you? Stop with your taunts and give me my next trial. If you wish to prolong your life, you will not make demands of me again, slave. Now for your trial. The last, darkest secrets of Tulak Horde are buried in his tomb. Lord Zash wants this text. But the final resting place of the dead lord is not easily trespassed. You will not be the first to die there. Yes, yes, yes. You send me into a tomb to do the impossible, hoping I die, and I come back and prove you wrong. Shut up, slave. I've had about enough of your mockery. Do not come back here until you've gotten the text from Tulak Horde's tomb. Out of my sight, slave. Come here, child. Do you intend to explore the Academy? To know the world that gave birth to the Sith? You should linger here a while. I am Overseer Raggate, a keeper of the old ways. I sense you have potential, and I can help you if you like. I have better things to do. Better than the opportunity I offer? You have power and strength in the Force, but you must be tested beyond the trials your masters have set for you. I administer the Rite of Blood and Bone, a ritual performed beyond this doorway. It is a rite acolytes have participated in for 10,000 years. I'm sure you were young and pretty back then. Yes, I am shriveled. I am infirm. Yet, I survive. More than most Sith can say. Learn from my example. In the chambers, past the gateway, there is a colony of Shyrax, my leather-winged, razor-talent children and their brood. They guard a mountain of skulls, an altar to the Academy's failures. You must reach the bones before proceeding. I'm... Dying of suspense, really. Then I will continue. You must claim a skull from the mountain and return to the antechamber. Soak the skull in the blood pool and come to me. Once bone has turned red, I will look and see your nature written in crimson stains. And possibly a glimpse of your future.
I'll admit that does sound intriguing. To complete the right is to accept one's death. To steal one's own mortality and drown it in the fluid of life. That is the symbolic purpose. But it is also a trial of power. As are all Sith trials, a trial to test strength and to grant it. I will await you here. If you die, I will forget you. 